Hello everyone. First of all, I'd like to thank you so much for clicking on this video. I'd like to ask you to stay all the way until the end, okay? Because there's going to be a lot of vital information. Now, my wife a few months ago uh, had a dream, another dream, okay? Uh, and I believe it was a, pr a prophetic dream from the Lord. I do really believe that in my spirit because as soon as she was telling me this dream, it lined up with a dream that I also had, okay? And I've posted this dream, and I'll put it up here somewhere. Please don't click it there now. Wait all the way to the end. I'll have it at the end. I'll also leave a little, uh, the video here so you can click and, and watch it later, okay? So, uh, and the video, I guess it speaks of uh, captivity, okay? Uh, my dream does, and her dream actually also followed uh, that captivity uh, scenario okay and uh so without further ado i want to let my wife uh, tell the dream to you guys so in this dream i was in the in the place that i don't know exactly what it was but i was approached by a, a lady um she came talk to me and she said that her daughter was pregnant and her daughter needed help because her daughter was somewhere being held captive meaning she could not leave that place so she this lady came to me asking if i could somehow help her daughter and her husband to get out of the place because she was pregnant and so i somehow was able to meet the daughter and the husband and i talked to them i said hey i'm gonna try to help you guys out and get out of here and she as i said she was pregnant and I asked her about the baby and yeah, that I think they were, yeah, sorry. I was, I asked about the baby and when I asked her about the baby, she said that she was going to have to give the baby for adoption. She could not keep the baby because they were suffered some kind of perse persecution. So she was pregnant, but she, as soon as she had the baby, she was going to have to give it to adoption. She did, didn't want to keep the baby and be like persecuted. Mm. so I was there like I was gonna try to help get her out of that situation but she was really afraid of everything that was happening and afraid that what was going to happen to the baby if she kept the baby so she just told me she decided to do that so the baby would not face any kind of um, persecution and yeah that was that was like a short dream so that was pretty much what happened there hmm. and when you when you met the mother the mother was not at this place where the daughter was uh, held captive at no there no. are different, uh, different yeah. places and this daughter could not leave that place no and i remember that she was really afraid because they were being persecuted and she was pregnant and she didn't want any harm or anything to happen to the baby hmm. interesting that's very interesting because uh, recently a few uh I guess, executive or leaders or presidents uh, from different countries uh, have actually said that, uh, you know, that the t children uh, the, do not belong to the parents. You know, children, they belong to, uh, I guess, society is what they call it, right? And this comes with this Marxist uh, idea, right? Uh, to remove the kids uh, from the parents kind of thing, right? Which is very uh, diabolic, uh, if you ask me. Um, again, we don't know, uh, what, you know, when this is going to happen or, or how or anything, but I, I'd like for you guys to pray, you know, uh, pray for God's deliverance, uh, protect uh, our children. God can very well do this, uh, as we've seen it happen many times in history in the Bible, you know, uh, Moses was protected when the, they're trying to take his life. Uh, Jesus was protected, you know, as well and so forth. So, you never know, and we have to be vigilant. And the Bible says, you know, that uh, my people perish for lack of knowledge. So I believe that God uses his people to warn the church, right? His prophets to let them know uh, what is to come. This is God's love and God's grace, right? And mercy towards us. So uh, yeah, I, I actually also had a dream, a prophetic dream. God has been giving uh, my wife and I uh, some prophetic dreams uh, to share it with you guys here. And it's uh, closely uh, relates to uh, captivity.
okay? And I will leave it here at the end for you to click and, and go take a look. Uh, but before you do that, please, uh, if you like this video, hit the like button, share it with someone, uh, and also, uh, you know, give it a comment, which really helps the algorithm here uh, as well. And please consider following, okay? And again, I have other social media platform that I also bring messages. Uh, and if you want to go check it out, if you like, that'd be, uh, you know, I'll be blessed to have you uh, follow and subscribe uh, as well. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. Stay until the end. God bless you and your family. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Take care.